test. Let me take you through some of the couple couple of updates we are getting from Pakistan now. According to Pakistan media, what we are getting to know is NAB DG Nazir Bhat, but who conducted the dramatic arrest or under whose aegis, of course, and leadership, the arrest of Imran Khan took place inside court premises on Tuesday has been sacked. Pakistan has appointed Director FIA Fakar Ahmed Chauhan as the new DG NAB. So this is of course one of the first big ramifications coming to light. What is the signal that is being given? Was the arrest uncalled for or was the arrest mishandled? That's the big question that emerges after the DG NAB has been sacked. More updates coming in and this is further relief for Imran Khan now. As I mentioned earlier, he's been given protective relief till May 17 on a few cases. But he's facing a large number of cases. So what we're coming to know now is that the Islamabad High Court has actually ordered no arrest of Imran Khan in any case until Monday morning. He has been granted a bail of sorts or protective bail in all cases finally. This is what his uh, lawyers have also been arguing for. They've been wanting all the cases against him to be clubbed and for him to be given details of what are these cases that have been filed against us. One of his lawyers earlier told us that he has nearly 150 cases against him Certainly 120 and more. So now at least till so now at least till Monday, Imran Khan cannot be arrested. He's expected to move to his house now and is also expected to address his followers. Let's go.